This morning, after a tragic end to the search for a missing girl in Texas, investigators found the body of 11 year old Audrey Cunningham after a five day search. The case is now raising questions about the suspect's past and why he was not required to register as a sex offender. Here's ABC's Lionel Moyes. This morning, new questions about whether the death of an 11 year old girl north of Houston could have been prevented as new details emerge about the suspect. The body of Audrey Cunningham was found in a local river yesterday after a five day search. Police say the river is one place the suspect, Don Stephen McDougal, told authorities he had recently been. My heart aches with this news and I express with my deepest sympathies and condolences to everyone who knew who cared for and loved Audrey. Water levels had to be lowered so divers could reach Audrey's body. She was reported missing last Thursday after failing to catch her bus to school. Investigators say McDougal, a friend of Audrey's father who lived in a camper behind their home, promised to take her to the bus that morning, but refused to tell investigators what happened next. McDougal's criminal history includes more than a dozen arrests. Records show he was indicted for attempted indecency to a child stemming from an incident in 2007. That charge would have required him to register as a sex offender, but he was allowed to plead down to a lesser charge of child enticement, avoiding sex offender registration. McDougal was taken into custody on an unrelated charge last week. As authorities questioned him in recent days, Audrey's mother held on to hope that her girl would be found alive. Not a single person could say anything bad about her. She's, she's not a bad child. She has so many opportunities ahead of her. An autopsy is now being performed to determine how Audrey died. McDougal could be facing capital murder charges. Lionel Moyes, ABC News, New York.